Greetings and salutations, my name is JW608, and today I am playing Star Maid. And we are working yet again on our little, um, modded miner. And we're trying to get the, uh, beam array proper. I uh, get it, uh, set up and aligned and all that jazz. Where's my salvage mods? Come on, where are your salvage mods? Well, there you go, boy. So... I was thinking, uh, and while well, reading the, the documentation, all that jazz, it's about, hold on, let me, let me do this real quick while I'm thinking. Oh, no, can't do that while I'm thinking. It's about um, 4,000 4, blocks make uh, the largest radius. So that's 10. These... This group of 15 by 15 by 15 is actually what, um, some 3,000? Oh, 6,750? Oh, for both. Okay, for both. Okay, so they're about 3,000. Uh, actually, since, oh, it's not attached to anything. That's why it's telling me how many there are. Ah, nope, not anymore. Yeah. See, it's about 3,000. So what if we flip it up like 20? That is 5,000. Okay. Uh, how about 17? Uh, that's 4,000, but also not quite what I wanted. There we go. 18. That is 4,050. All right. Well, let's go 19 for good measure. So I don't think it was exactly 4,000. Oh, all right. We'll go 20 and just call it call it even. So this should provide us the optimal or the large, not optimal, but the largest uh, ray effect. 15. Drop you to zero, except you can't drop it to zero because it only drops to one. There we go. Let's bring you back up to 20. All right, and. Ah, that works perfectly. And then there. We need to find the middle of this, which is probably going to be roughly right there ish. I'm going to eyeball it. And roughly middle, roughly middle. All right, and we need to connect all of these up and get us a new camera. I'm thinking this is going to do a lot better than the last, than the last setup. Um. Well, that's not good. Oh, server's auto saving. There you. Wait a minute. Okay. Um. There we go. When the server saves, it uh, it has problems sometimes. How are you changing from focused to unfocused? Well, first of all, let me bring this down closer to the middle. So there. No. Closer to the middle. Come on. There we go. All right, how am I changing from focused to unfocused? I'm pressing five on my numpad because that's what I have it set to. Um, you come down to controls, keyboard bindings. Let's see, where is it? Uh, ship controls. It's switch weapon firing mode. I think it's default set to like left alt, but that is set to like three other functions. So I changed it to numpad five. So focused or unfocused when you don't have a target, it's always unfocused, but um, focused all the weapon outputs try to converge to one point, whereas unfocused, they just kind of shoot straight out. We want this to be unfocused. We want to go pew. All right. 
that is not what I wanted it to do. So can we set these as the weapon outputs then? Okay, that is closer. All right, so let's find us a new asteroid. Whee. Oh look, some new asteroids. That 6012-23, Minus from the first and last. What are we on? Let's see, this is 6012-23. I can tell it right there, or there. Did I go? No, I didn't. 6012-23, which is also appears to have a station at. A shop, even. I did see there were some mods that increase the number of asteroids and redistribute resources and all that jazz. I might look into those eventually. But right now, we just want to mine. Well, asteroids is probably isn't going to be the primary purpose of this miner I'm thinking of. Although I want it to do asteroids and do them well. So we're going to get up nice and close and go click. There we go. That's more what I wanted. Just this vacuum of getting these little guys gonna be annoying, but this vacuum of resources, like a resource vacuum. Come on. To leave bits of asteroid just kind of wandering around. Ah, we're just going to leave bits of asteroid wandering around. Now you may be saying, well, what were you thinking of its actual purpose? Well, I was thinking something more like this. Planet mining. These planets have tons of cool stuff in them. So get me a anti-grav chamber so I can hover or crack the core or whichever. And then just... Melt the planet. To give it a second to figure out what it's what it's doing. That was a lot faster than I thought it should be. What resources are we looking at? Uh let's see. A lot of everything. Plants, wood, surtees, jisper. Usually each plate has one or, uh, well, has one ore and one mineral on it. And it's not necessarily matching. I don't recall it necessarily being matching. It doesn't necessarily match the asteroids, that is. And there we can just vacuum up a planet. Great. <laughs> uh, something very therapeutic about just consuming a world. Although the atmosphere is bothering me. There we go. This is the mining I have always wanted to do. But in, well, especially in. Uh, quick fire vanilla or power 2.0 vanilla it was practically impossible to do those yeah I was gonna say no no it wasn't practically impossible no it was practically impossible to do this on this scale I love it oh this is the most beautiful thing I've done in a long time in star made uh, zoom an entire planet <laughs> I hunger. Too bad you can't do more stuff with this dirt nonsense. Like grass and stuff. I would like a mod that would let me convert that to useful things. Like uh, capsules or stuff like that. 
That would be cool. Have a, a extra factory block that converts garbage blocks into useful stuff at like a, a tremendous cost, like a thousand, or well, maybe like a hundred dirt blocks give you a piece of vertigy or something like that. There we go. We've done absolutely no damage to the planet other than we've stripped it of all of its natural resources and blocks. We did not destroy the core. That is very important. <laughs> All right, so what does it look like when you eat about four asteroids and an entire planet? Well, you get lots of trees, lots of foliage, more grass than you'll ever consume. Actually, let's just dump everything. Let's get rid of it all. So tease, goodbye. It's out of curiosity. Just what will a plate give me? Without any bonuses or anything like that, just raw raw mining the lucro is probably not from that planet do you have any nice planets oh you have a purple planet i have a fondness for purple planets i think it's because the series started on a purple planet spawn in you must die so the storage is empty and let's just let's just shoot this plate try to get close to a plate as we can we're probably going to consume lots of the others but that's part of this plate this is not a scalpel this is a great big hammer that's most of this plate actually it's most of that planet as well because we've picked up, uh, we've actually gutted this plate, and oh, it shot through the back. All right, so let's just go get the whole planet then. It's not gonna take as long as I thought, because I'm mining faster than it renders, and also planets don't work right. It would probably be a lot, lot. Uh, better for the game if I were to destroy the planet first but ever since power 2.0 destroyed planets and plates and all that nonsense is uh, not working quite right I'm gonna go focused yeah focus I'm gonna get that little little beam while unfocused lets me have the big clover shape there we go Oh, we're not going to be really picky. We're not going to consume every last block of the planet. We're just going to get the big chunks. Oh. See, yeah, I saw the resources. Yeah, but if I recall, every plate has a ore and a... And a... Uh, crystal to it and I don't think yeah it's not the same on each plate I think it's randomly generated actually it used to be at least I thought it used to be every planet had every resource on it but I don't know if that's true or not or if, at least if it's true now it may have been true in the past I read or heard that somewhere so theoretically you should be able to build anything just on pl from planet mining alone this is probably not a good activity to partake in on a server because planets and servers aren't friends and don't build on planets if you're on a server everyone will hate you right so that's that's pretty much the planet so that's a radius of 96 purple planet uh, what did it net us? We have 300,000 purple rock, 500,000 purple top stuff, 170,000 purple vine stuff, 24,000 centaur, sapson, 40,000, 2,000 yoles, purple weeds, fan flowers, all that nonsense, persine, ramet, hatel, 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 hilat, I'm sorry. Surtees, Matties, Bastion, and Verret. 
looks like anywhere from six to fifteen thousand each. Wow, that's not bad. A lot of Centir on this planet. Centir and Sapson were my my good ones, which I recall you need for shields. So that's that's good stuff. Alright. Planet mining is going to be uh, easier with this mod. And it's also going to be much more profitable. Now, if I slap on mining bonus chambers and then a faction mining bonus, wow. Of course, mining all my own planets and my system might not be the best idea. Well, it probably is the best idea. Because planets are evil. Besides, we're in a spaceship game. You should be in a space, not in a planet. In a space. You should be in space, not on a planet. <laughs> Anywho, I have been JW608. This has been Star Made, and I will dig you cats later.